Hello friends, gone are the days when you needed different USB to create a bootable USB for different operating systems. As now in just a single USB, you can have an unlimited number of bootable operating systems. In this video, I will show you how to create a bootable USB in a single USB from which you can boot Windows 8, Windows 10, Windows 11 and Ubuntu or any other operating system you want. If your need is only for one single operating system, then still you can use this method, as later on by just copying another ISO, it will work as a bootable USB for that operating system also. It's really easy, so please follow along without missing any step. To get started, all you need is one USB drive. The larger the size, the more operating systems you can fit onto it. For this demonstration, I will be using a 32 GB USB drive. Before we begin, make sure your USB is empty or doesn't contain any important data as everything will be wiped off. After inserting the USB, open the web browser and search for Ventoy. Then click on the Ventoy website. Once you're on the home page, click on the downloads button on the top bar. On the downloads page, you'll see three different versions of Ventoy. Since I'm using Windows, I will click on the Windows version, which will redirect me to another page. Scroll down on that page and once again click on the version of Ventoy you want to download and Ventoy will be downloaded as a zip file. I will move the zip file out of my downloads folder and onto my desktop so it will be easier for you to follow along. Next we need to extract the files from the zip folder. And to do this, right click on the folder and then click on Extract All. Then select the destination where you want to extract the files. Then click on Extract and it will extract the files to your desired location. Then open the extracted Ventoy folder and double click on this Ventoy 2 disk file and a box like this will open up. Now here's something important not to forget. Click on Options and in the drop down you will see a different menu. Here, ensure that the Secure Boot support is checked. This step is crucial because most computers have a feature called Secure Boot. It's a BIOS feature that only allows drives and disks to run if they are signed in a specific way. If this is not checked then you will have to manually enable the BIOS to allow this to run. Then for the partition style keep it as MBR. Then check to see if the selected device is the USB you want to install Ventoy into as the data in the selected device will be completely erased. Then click on the install button to install Ventoy onto your USB drive. You will receive a warning prompt stating that the drive will be formatted and all data on the drive will be erased. Simply click yes and then you will be prompted again to confirm. Click on yes again and Ventoy will start installing onto your USB. When it's complete, you'll receive a prompt confirming that Ventoy was successfully installed onto your USB. Then click on OK. Here you can see Ventoy has been installed in your device. Later on when there is an update to a newer version of Ventoy, you can click on the update button to update Ventoy on the USB and the bootable ISOs which you would have on it will not be affected. Now close this, as Ventoy has been installed in your USB and here you can see that your USB has automatically been named Ventoy. Now I will click on it to open it and here you can easily copy the ISO which you have downloaded. If you don't know how to create an ISO of the operating system, you will find the link in the description. Now open the folder where you have downloaded the ISO of the operating system. Here you can see I have the ISO of Windows 8, 10, 11, Ubuntu and a Hiren Boot CD which includes all diagnostic, repair and retrieval tools. To copy, all you need to do is select the ISO and drag and drop it into the USB folder. After the copying finishes, your bootable USB will be ready to be used. 
If you are still watching this video, then please do like and subscribe. Now to use it, just plug the USB into your PC and boot from the USB. To do so, press the power button on your computer. And during the initial startup screen, press the F12 key on your keyboard and you will enter the boot menu. For different brand of computers, you will have to press a different function keys and you will find the details of it in the description. Then here the primary bootable device is to be selected as USB, after which when the computers get started, it boots from the USB and you will see the Ventoys menu will all the operating systems. Select the operating system you want to install and for demonstration purpose, I will select Windows 8, after which you will see the Windows 8 setup. I will not go further and if you want to see the installation process of an operating system, you will find the link in the description. Hope this video was helpful to you. If so, then please do like this video and subscribe to my channel.